about that off duty Chicago police officer who was shot to death this weekend on the city's south side. The 24 year old had just finished up her shift and was heading home in Avalon Park early yesterday morning when she was killed. NBC 5's Christian Farr has an update on the investigation tonight. Chicago police detectives are continuing to investigate a case that involves the death of one of their own. Many outside of the department are trying to help, including a community activist. And the fact that somebody would just come grab her life just like that, they need to be put to justice and held accountable immediately. Community activist Jamal Green is offering a reward for information after off-duty Chicago police officer Ariana Preston was shot and killed early Saturday morning. Green announced the reward on social media, which he says has grown since the former candidate for mayor made that post. Now, hopefully a reward can get people talking. You know, we have a code of silence in these neighborhoods. You know, we want people to speak up. The shooting that took Preston's life happened at about 2 a.m. near the 100 block of South Blackstone. Officer Preston, who had only been on the force for three years, was shot and killed after arriving home from work near Soldier Field Sunday morning. I would like for us to pause for a moment of silence to honor Officer Ariana Preston, who was tragically taken from us yesterday. Officer Preston's name was read along with the names of other Chicago police officers who have died since December of 2021. The honor took place during the annual St. Jude March, which recognizes the sacrifice officers make to protect and serve. Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. While receiving his own honor at Fellowship Chicago Church in Fuller Park, community activist Early Walker talked about Officer Preston's death and the continuing fight to end Chicago's ongoing gun violence problem. Her death is a tragic reminder of the urgent need for action. We must honor her memory by coming together to end this crisis once and for all. Jamal Green says that his reward has grown from $2,000 to $5,000. And ISU, where Preston graduated, issued a statement saying that Preston was a standout student filled with passion and compassion, a real force for change, and exactly the type of person you hope will enter law enforcement. Preston had also received her master's degree recently. At 35th in Michigan, Christian Farr, NBC5 News.